Patrick, how you doing? Hey Steve, I'm doing well. You want to talk about your new amazing sculpture here? Yeah, so um, this piece is called Beast of Futures Past and um, it's meant to meant to kind of uh, look like an animal that is hybridized with a piece of uh, farm machinery. So it's it's got both machine elements and kind of animal elements. Um, these panels are kind of feathers or scales or solar panels, whatever you want to see there. Um, but the whole thing's supposed to kind of seem like it's alive and part, part of the environment. Well, it's pretty cool. How long did it take to make? Exactly. Uh, well, we've been here 29 days, so. Yeah. Um, I'd say that's a lot of progress. It, it felt good. Yeah, we, we were working pretty fast. Yeah. I was working pretty fast. So this is all mild steel, and then you patinaed it with uh, what? We, uh, you know, I've used a lot of things now. We started with a vinegar and salt patina. Um, and then uh, I switched over, rinsed all that off once that had kind of bit and did a water patina. So most of this is just kind of multiple spritzings of water. So, so when you're not at Buffalo Creek Art Center, where are you? Um, I teach uh, sculpture. I'm a professor of sculpture at Western Michigan University in Kalamazoo, Michigan. And that's my full-time gig. And then I'm off making sculpture in the summer. Well, terrific. So. People want to see more of your work, where will they go? Go to uh, Patrick D. Wilson Sculpture on Instagram or PatrickDWilson.com. All right, well, thanks a lot. This is going to be a real nice addition to our Buffalo Creek Art Center Sculpture Park. Thanks. Thrilled to have it here. Well, thank you.